Hey, it's Lane with Windows10Update.com, and today I want to tell you how to make your PC run faster and boot faster. This is a very simple trick to help you with your BIOS times, and then also to help your PC just generally run a little bit faster. So every time you boot up your machine, certain programs may start automatically. And depending on what these programs are, they may be using a lot of resources in the background. So for example, when I boot up my machine, a couple of programs do start up automatically. Skype is one and OneDrive is another. Now depending on how extensively you use OneDrive and you use uh, photo syncing or file syncing up to the cloud, this may be something that you want to keep going, uh, but there may be other programs that you will see start up automatically that can use a lot of resources unnecessarily. So let me go ahead and show you how you can find out what programs are running in the background and what you can do about that. So if you go down here and right click on the start menu tip and then go to your task manager. So your task manager is of course going to show you any programs that are currently running. So these are the three apps that are running, task manager, snip, and audacity. And then there are a number of background processing, hap uh, background processes happening right now. As you can see, this one right here, Active Presenter, it is recording my screen. So of course that is taking up some memory. Cortana is also taking up some memory here. And the reason that we don't see any major problems right here, other than let's say with Skype, which is again something that I knew was running in the background, is that I've actually cleared out some of the programs that were automatically starting and running in the background. So what we can do here, if we go over to the tab in the task manager that says startup, you can see the applications that are currently um, set to start up automatically. You can see the last time my PC booted, it took 11 seconds uh, for everything to completely finish. And now this is a Surface Pro 3 and, and actually that is actually a pretty slow boot time and it's because of these two applications, these three applications that are starting up when the system boots up. As you can see, I've disabled some other applications that were also starting up and slowing down my system. Steam is an example. If you're a gamer, your, uh, your Steam client is probably starting up whenever you start your machine and then continuously running in the background doing things like checking for updates to games. If you use Adobe Creative Cloud, that will also be something that starts up automatically. It will continue to look for updates and it will give you annoying notifications when updates are available. So all you want to do if some of these seem unnecessary to you, what you can do is just go ahead and click on it. So if the application is starting up automatically, you can just check this or uh, click this button here that says disable. Now you can also see there is a startup impact measurement here. So these three applications, it's telling me that the startup impact is high. So it's taking a lot of extra time for these applications to start up. So you may have an application here that says startup, uh, startup impact is low, so that may not bother you very much. But I would encourage you to go ahead and check your background processes and take a look at the ones that are actually using a lot of your memory. So you may find something there that, uh, that may surprise you. So that's how you can speed up your PC and increase those or decrease those boot times. Thanks for watching.